This is Pratima from Planet Physiology. In this session, we are going to learn about gastrointestinal hormones. Gastrointestinal hormones are polypeptide in nature and act in paracrine as well as endocrine fashion. Many of these hormones also act as neurotransmitters in central nervous system. Based on their structural and functional similarities, these hormones are classified into two families. The first is gastrin family that mainly includes gastrin and cholecystokinin and the second is secretin family which includes secretin, glucagon, GIP and VIP. Hormones like motilin, substance P, GRP, somatostatin, peptide YY, serotonin, neurotensin, ghrelin etc. do not fit in any of these two families and hence are included in others. There are more than 15 types of enteroendocrine cells in GI tract like G cells, S cells, I cells that secrete only one type of hormone. Whereas enterochromaffin or ECL cells secrete serotonin and histamine. Let us begin with gastrin. It is secreted by G cells of pyloric glands these are flask shaped cells with apex facing the lumen of the gland. Microvilli are present on the apex and possess receptors which mediate gastrin secretion in response to the changes in the gastric contents. Gastrin is synthesized as pre-progastrin and then processed into the fragments of various sizes. Based on the number of amino acids, they are named as G34, G17, G14, etc. Apart from these, other forms of gastrin are also secreted in circulation. However, G17 is the principal form of gastrin that is concerned with gastric acid secretion. It has half-life of 2 to 3 minutes in circulation and then is inactivated in kidneys and small intestine. Gastrin secretion is increased by distension of stomach, presence of amino acids in stomach, vagal stimulation, calcium ions and epinephrine, whereas its secretion is decreased by excess of acid in stomach. This is negative feedback action, partly mediated via action of acid on the G cells and partly by secretion of somatostatin. Presence of hormones like secretin, GIP, VIP, glucagon, calcitonin also inhibit gastric secretion. Since negative feedback also regulates gastrin secretion, its levels are chronically elevated in case of pernicious anemia where parietal cells are damaged which lead to decreased or absence of acid production. Principal physiological actions of gastrin are secretion of hydrochloric acid and pepsinogen in stomach. And this action is mediated via CCKB receptors on parietal cells. Gastrin also has trophic action on intestine, that is, it stimulates growth of gastrointestinal mucosa. Other actions include increase in gastric motility as well as gastric emptying, contraction of lower esophageal sphincter, and this helps to prevent gastric regurgitation. Gastrin also stimulates insulin secretion, especially after protein diet. Next hormone in gastrin family is cholecystokinin pancreozymin. Earlier it was called as cholecystokinin due to its action on gallbladder, but later it was discovered to possess important role in release of pancreatic enzymes and hence the word pancreozymin is added to it. Cholecystokinin pancreozymin is secreted by eye cells in duodenum and jejunum. It is also found in neurons of distal ileum and colon as well as cerebral cortex. The most important stimulus for its release is presence of peptides and amino acids in duodenum. It is also released in response to long chain fatty acids which has more than 10 carbon atoms. CCK secretion is regulated by positive feedback mechanism. Presence of partially digested end products of proteins and fat cause release of CCK which in turn stimulate release of pancreatic juice and bile. 
विच एड इन देयर डाइजेशन एंड एब्सॉर्बन दस इट शोज पॉजिटिव फीडबैक रेगुलेशन सी सी के पी जेड इज ऑल्सो सिक्रेटेड इन वेरियस फॉर्म्स लाइक सी सी के फिफ्टी एट थर्टी नाइन थर्टी थ्री ट्वेल्व एट एंड फोर आउट ऑफ दीज सी सी के ट्वेल्व एंड सी सी के एट आर primary actions of cholecystokinin pancreozymin include contraction of gall bladder which is also called as cholagog action and secretion of pancreatic juice rich in enzymes it also causes relaxation of sphincter of ori that aids in release of these juices in duodenum apart from these actions cckpz also augments action of secretin it increases secretion of enterokinase which is necessary for conversion of trypsinogen to trypsin it inhibits gastric emptying by causing contraction of pyloric sphincter this also prevents regurgitation of duodenal contents into stomach cckpz enhances intestinal motility it exerts trophic effect on pancreas and stimulates glucagon secretion it is also concerned with regulation of food intake and production of anxiety as well as analgesia now let us study hormones of secretin family the first is secretin itself it is the first hormone discovered in 1902 by baylis and starling it is released by s cells of upper small intestine in response to presence of acidic chyme as well as partially digested proteins in duodenum but acidic chyme is the most potent stimulus for its release it has 27 amino acids in it the most important action of secretin is to release bicarbonate rich secretion from pancreas as well as bile and this is necessary to neutralize acids entering in the duodenum This also helps to provide optimum pH for the enzyme action. Secretin also augments action of CCKPZ. It decreases acid secretion by stomach and inhibits gastric emptying by causing contraction of pyloric sphincter. Thus, secretin makes sure that chyme is released in a controlled way that can be effectively handled by the duodenum. Next hormone is gastric inhibitory polypeptide which is abbreviated as gip it is secreted by k cells in duodenum and jejunum and has 42 amino acids gip is released in response to glucose and fats in duodenum it was found that in higher doses it inhibits gastric secretion as well as motility and hence named as gastric inhibitory peptide but later it was found that this action was only seen in higher doses but in physiological doses it stimulates insulin secretion it is also called as glucose dependent insulinotropic peptide the next gi hormone is vasoactive intestinal polypeptide or vip it is secreted as a co-transmitter with acetylcholine by the nerve fibers supplying salivary glands It is also found in the nerves in the GI tract as well as in the blood. It has 28 amino acids. It is mainly concerned with secretion of electrolytes and hence water by the intestinal mucosa. It also causes relaxation of gastrointestinal smooth muscles as well as sphincters. It leads to dilatation of peripheral blood vessels and inhibition of gastric acid secretion. VIP potentiates action of acetylcholine in salivary glands because of its action of electrolyte and water secretion and vasodilatation VIP secreting tumors which are called as VIPomas lead to diarrhea the next hormone is motilin it is secreted by enterochromaffin cells as well as MO cells of stomach small intestine as well as colon it has 22 amino acids and it causes contraction of smooth muscles of stomach small intestine as well as large intestine especially during interdigestive period thus it regulates intestinal motility during interdigestive phase and it is responsible for production of migrating motor complexes which are also called as mmc 
Somatostatin, which is also called as growth hormone inhibiting hormone, is secreted by delta cells of islets of pancreas as well as D cells in gastrointestinal mucosa. It is secreted in two forms, somatostatin 14 and 28. It inhibits secretion of gastrin, GIP, VIP, secretin and motilin. It also inhibits secretion of pancreatic juice, gastric juice as well as gastric motility. It inhibits gallbladder contraction as well as inhibits absorption of glucose, amino acids and triglycerides. Next hormone is neurotensin. It is secreted by ileum in response to fatty acids and it contains 13 amino acids. It is responsible for decrease in the gastrointestinal motility and it increases blood flow through the ileum. Next is substance P. It is secreted by endocrine cells as well as nerve cells in GIT and it increases motility of small intestine. Gastrin releasing polypeptide or GRP is secreted by vagal nerve endings to the G cells or the pyloric glands. It has 27 amino acids and it increases gastrin secretion. Peptide YY is released from jejunum in response to fat and it inhibits gastric acid secretion as well as gastric motility. Ghrelin is another gastrointestinal hormone secreted by stomach and it has role in central control of food intake. It also stimulates growth hormone secretion. The last hormone we are going to study is guanilin. It is secreted by intestinal mucosa right from pylorus till the rectum and it has 15 amino acids. Guanilin regulates fluid movements in intestine as well as other tissues like kidneys, liver and female reproductive tract and basically it integrates actions of intestine and kidneys. So here we finish with the gastrointestinal hormones. Let us study some important MCQs. A 50 year old male was presented with complaint of severe epigastric pain, frequent heartburn and unexplained weight loss of about 12 kg over the period of 6 months. He also claims to have no relief from antihistaminic drugs. Upper GI endoscopy revealed erosion and ulcerations of proximal duodenum and increased fasting gastric acid output. The patient is most likely to have tumor secreting which of the following hormones? A. Secretin B. Gastrin C. Cholecystokinin D. Somatostatin Next, which of the following gastrointestinal hormones is not a part of secretin family? A. Glucagon B. GIP C. VIP D. Motilin Which hormone causes gallbladder contraction? A. Gastrin B. Secretin C. Motilin D. Cholecystokinin Number 4. Following are the actions of secretin except A. Stimulation of bicarbonate secretion B. To augment action of CCK C. Stimulation of gastric acid secretion and D. Contraction of pyloric sphincter Number 5. Following are the actions of CCKPZ except A. To stimulate secretion of pancreatic enzymes B. Regulation of food intake C. Production of anxiety and D. Hydrocholeritic action Number 6. Which of the following is not the action of VIP? A. Inhibition of gastric acid secretion B. Stimulation of pancreatic secretion C. Inhibition of gastric motility and D. Vasoconstriction of gastrointestinal vessels. Number 7. Which is the first hormone discovered? A. Gastrin B. Secretin C. Cholecystokinin and D. Insulin Number 8. 
All of the following act in paracrine or juxtacrine fashion within GIT except A. Adenosine B. Peptide YY C. Histamine and D. Substance P Number 9. Presence of which of the following in duodenum acts as the best stimulus to release CCKPZ? A. Peptides and amino acids B. Fatty acids with less than 10 carbon atoms C. Acidic chyme and D. Disaccharides And the last one which of the following hormones regulate gastrointestinal motility during interdigestive phase? A. Ghrelin B. Peptide YY C. Motilin and D. Substance P So that's all for this session. Thank you. If you enjoy my sessions, press the like button and share it with your friends. If you haven't yet subscribed my channel, press the subscribe button. To get notifications about new releases, press bell icon. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.